Hello folks, welcome to the channel where myself, Al Pal, here's a new game for you. This is Founder's Fortune. Now I saw this one and I thought, yep, yeah, this would be nice to try. Now I did buy this game. Uh, a fantasy village builder focused on creative building, uh, colonist psychology, base defense, uh, handle resources, farming, production tools, diplomacy, families, uh, trading, defense and research, as well as the wishes, expectations, thoughts and equipment of every villager and I thought this sounds pretty good I like little games like this they're pretty smart so let's jump in I've, I've had a little nose in here I'll be honest with you I have been in um, because I just wanted to suss the controls out to see what's what but I've had a, probably had about five minutes so we're gonna go new game anyway um, map size exciting world let's do it on calm for the moment I mean you can so it's pretty unexciting, right? But basically what exciting is, is um, as opposed to calm, it depends on how many uh, people invade you and fights and stuff like that. There's a lot in it. There's a lot in this game. It's really good, though. It's good fun. Um, you can leave these as they are. You get you start the game with these two colonists, and basically it expands. They come in by boat or whatever they want. I suppose there's other methods. I saw one come in by boat um, not long after I've been in the game, so... Um, but it tells you all about them, their personality, tireless experience in battle. Uh, that's quite a good one. Um, a miner. Yeah, I'm going to keep that because she is a miner. But you can just go random. See, um, good health, pessimist. She's a doctor. Skills. Uh, master miner. Actually, they're, well, they're, they're good. She's got a good one. They're both, they're almost twins, aren't they? Hannah Fontaine. Okay. Can you change their name? No. Right, let's jump in then. Let's have a look. If you like this, don't forget, folks, take the time at the like button. Uh, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe. And if you want to see more, hit that like button and um, maybe we'll do some more. Let's, go, let's see where we go. Um, right, so this changes. This wasn't like this last time I came in. So it must randomise every time you start the game. Um, is there a map button? Not that I can see. Now, see these down here? Look, with the red lines. Yeah, you want to watch out for these. They, they will kill you, these things here. So keep clear of them ones, the little goblin hut things. Um, we're over here. There's some more little huts here, but they they seem quite friendly, actually. They're not bad. There's no red bars on them, so, yeah, I'm happy with that. Right, and we're down here. Mm -hmm. There we are. Hannah and horse. Now, first of all, we need to get wood. We haven't got any. So let's click that. Light a fire. That attracts them. If you've got a fire going, you'll attract them. Now, we put a bed down as well. You've got to sleep somewhere. Let's, let's, let's put three. Three will do. And food as well. Let's put that down. So, they're, well, with this, basically, they'll always come here when they're hungry. It's automated. So, mm -hmm. click, right click on. Let's go this one yep. first. Right click her. Now, she's going to take ownership of that bed. They'll sleep when they want to sleep, or you can make them if you want. Now, expectation fulfilled. Brilliant. Now, let's go right-click over here, cut the tree, and the mm -hmm. same with horse. Actually, see now, with the options, we've got a horse. They can mine, uh, mine the iron ore, but we uh, probably, or you can talk to it if you want to, or kill it, or tame it, or fight it. Uh, but we, we want the wood. We really need to get some building. Now, with number keys, one, two, three, four, you can speed it up which is quite handy. Now, they will go from one tree to the next on their own. Now, that bed, that's there for when the colonists come. They'll probably come in here by boat. And you have to accept them or reject them or kill them or fight them or maim them, whatever you want to do to them. There you go. A few migrants have seen our fire signal. That's what this is for. Like I said, it attracts them. Uh, and just arrived in a small boat. Uh, send the colonists to accept them. Okay, so now what we're going to do is... Yeah. Yeah. Now you go over to there, you right click. Now see, there's all your things you can... You can... Risky joke, insult, fight, kill. Let's accept, because we need them to help us. And let's left click on that one. We can't yet until she's accepted. Or he. He or she, whatever that is, I don't know. There we go. Happy smile. <laughs> Take ownership of the bed. Louisa. 
Come on. Okay, she's done it. She's got the bed. Now, what we want Louisa to do is basically get her finger out. She ain't living here for free. And let's speed it up just a little tad. And the horse, we want the horse to do some chopping as well. I think we need probably going to need a bit of storage, don't we? There we are. The storage there, so so you can stockpile your wood and stuff like that. That's good enough. Uh, we need cotton and other bit. See, look, he just carries on. They, they sort of do what they want. Look, even the bloody animals have gone to sleep. They're all getting 40 winks around here. God, it's making me tired looking at them. They're, they're all dropping. I'm just, look, oh, God, look, even the pigs. And I'm just wondering, is night time? Can you do, like, raids and stuff like that? Well, I don't know. I suppose as the game progresses, we'll find out. Um, are they asleep? Oh, some are. Look at that. Could you go and kill him while he's asleep? I mean, see, look, you can. If I clicked on one of ours, you can left-click on them or right-click on them and, and go over to kill them. Um, if you left-click on her, for instance, see this little... Click that. Now she's in combat mode. See, look, oh, bolt it up, ready to fight. But we don't want that. We'll take that off. We don't want any killing going on. Not just yet. Um, look at this, we've got so much stonage next to us. This is this is really good stuff. See, they're all munching. They just go when they want. So let's go for... She's getting a bit of a rest. Mm -hmm. She ain't bloody done nothing yet. Right, mine's done. Mm -hmm. Louisa, cut the tree. What's she not impressed with? Mm -hmm. Pessimistic, bad conversation. You're not here to chat, you're here to work. Don't want to work, get out. Oh, you can't get a staff nowadays. Um, can we give her a, a job as a forester? Is she going to do it? There she is. She's a forester, so... She's going to get the mine. Uh, Louisa, um, hang on a minute, let's have a look at their wishes, mm -hmm. so let's click on Louisa, what's she wishing for, get research books down in the colony, and get a healing potion cabinet in the colony as well, right, what we got, what the hell is that, it's a grave, alright, we don't, I don't think we need that, Um, this is all the building where we can build walls on the floors. We're not getting enough wood. See, it's starting to come in there now. We've got, we've got a couple in there. When we get a bit more, we'll start putting floors down. And you can do it in stone. Uh, bottom left corner, build walls and floors. There we go. Uh, stairs. Fortifications. Uh, farming. Work. There we go. Research book stand. We need one of them. Needs to be placed in a finished room. Oh, well, we ain't got one. Okay. So let's go with floors then. Let's build our little place. Yeah. It'll only go to how much wood you got. See, now it's gone orange, 165 wood. We haven't got that much. But we can go that. There we go. Speed him up a little bit. Right, so they'll just carry on until all the wood's gone to do that. Um, he's still getting wood there. He's still mining stone. I'd like to put storage down for the stone, actually. There we go. Good. Now we're going to need some cotton at some point. Oh, there we go. There's cotton over here. She's doing the floor, chopping trees. Yeah. Let's take this one out to gather cotton. And there's more cotton over there. Now you've got to be careful here 
because we are next to these. Now they seem all right. Four cotton. Speed her up a little bit. Where's she going? It's still doing the floor, this one. Yep. Mm -hmm. uh, new colony well rested. It's not like I've been able to sleep in a comfortable mm -hmm. bed. Yeah, I know, we're working on it. Uh, so it's Louisa's got the wishes for the research book stand and the healing potion. Okay. Not that all the pigs do not just wake up at the same time. Do you know what? I might make a right click. So, we've, oh, we've already got a forester, haven't we? Okay. So she can become a miner. Who was the one with, that was good with mining? Oh, look, they're all on building the floor. Cover writing, great research button colony. Slow them down a bit. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I don't know who it was. Mm-hmm. One of them was good at mining. Alright, so science. Yeah. Need a research book was that yeah, I know we are working on that. Research overview, so research woodworking. Simple wooden dresser. Looks like that's what's doing now. Is that coming up? Yeah, I don't know what advance is it, but it's going. And what's this one? This is old diplomacy. Okay. The honorable warriors, the humble people, children of the forest, and little people. Okay. Combat mode. In combat mode, your colonists will put on their combat equipment. So if you've got all armor and that all made up in storage, they'll all go put that on and they'll, they'll prep themselves up ready for it. It's a good little game. But there's a lot in it. Uh, look, we've got crystals here. get two crystals a minute um, see she's a forester so she'll just walk off and find wood wherever but I don't want her to walk into wrong territory so you got to be careful I don't know if she would mm -hmm. someone's become a miner I like that they just, you tell them to do it once and then, like the food, you put the food down and then, you know, they'll just go and get what's Oh, she's resting. Okay. So, let's go for, let's put a door. Needs to be built. Up. Right, okay, so we've got to put the walls in first. Right, I've got that. Simple wooden wall. Clean wood more. Well, wood more for settlers with good taste. 1.2 wood. Right. So. So we can just do that like that. I put the doors into it. There we go. Uh, small palisade gate. Oh, there's a lot of stuff here. Uh, windows. There we go. Now, can we put in the other bit that she was after? To shut her up. 
Research book stand. Not enough wood. All oh, right, but so right now we're out of wood. Okay. Right. Let's go and get some resources then. Okay. So a trader has arrived. A trader just made landfall on the coast. Send the colonists to haggle for some good deals. Oh, right inside my house and all. He's sleeping between the logs. Um, where's everybody gone? So she's chopping there. This one's going for crystal. Mm -hmm. So, how to move furniture and other objects? Drag the object to the mass its location. Okay. That one. And he's just going ahead and moving it for me. There you go. Fantastic. So now they can actually sleep in the house. And I was going to do all of them. Good. Oh, Louise has hurt her leg. Where's Louis? Louis, there she is. Mm -hmm. Splint your leg. She's doing something there. Leg splint successful. Beautiful. Mm. Running out of food. Okay, so let's go back into where is it there? Now we want yep. you to go and talk. If I can get him out of there. Dude, what are you doing? Mm -hmm. uh, talk, trade. gone. Damn it. I think we missed him. Mm -hmm. So you can see by looking at him, see, horse has got the axe at the end of his name, so obviously he's the chippy. The other one, Louisa, is a miner. And Hannah is a pain in the arse. Where's she gone? Well, there she is. She's down here. Right, okay. Um, she could become the mm -hmm. farmer. Talk, tame, kill. Tame? Run out of food. <laughs> She's slapping it. Oh, they both are. They're all going. Where's the other one? Forced. Yep. Here it comes. Speed it up. He can't. Is the pig's unconscious? Is it a pig? Is it a sheep? The sheep's unconscious. They're giving it a dry slap. Is he going to take the meat out of it? Horse doesn't... Do, oh, right, okay, so take him out of combat mode. Now he's going to get his hands messy. Oh. And there's the pigs coming over the back, so we could have a bit of sort of bacon, a bit of lamb. You can't speed it up. It's the last day of spring. Oh my god, they, they're a kick it. Look! Dudes, what are you doing? Bandage wounds. 
Is he paying? He's not paying the wound. Oh my god! What's up with him? Yep. Oh. Yeah. Oh. 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 Oh my god. Bandit's rolling. What is he doing? Dude, seriously? You want to get out of here? They're all looking pretty good. I, I think we've, um, they've been attacked by the sheep. I think the sheep have, um, look, they fell on the sheep. What the hell's going here? Mm-hmm. Kill? Yep. A, a bandage one, I don't know what's going on. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Bandage wounds. Um, I think we've killed them all. And they're coming back to finish me off. Well, there we go. Okay, there you go, guys. There's a Founder's Fortune. As you can see, there's so much in it. It's a really intense game. Um, very deep, but you can do so much as well. You can totally screw it up like I did. Well, you can follow the guidelines. You can keep on with the house building. Um, you can put all the other things in, like the, uh, the research stand that's wanted in there and the medication. I don't know what we can do with that. Oh. Work slowly. There we go. It's doing some Health's going up. On Louisa. Right. So what about mm -hmm. Hannah? Mm -hmm. Unconscious. Hundred percent. I don't know what's going on actually. Yeah. Hurt leg. Walk slowly. I understand that we need to watch our food consumption, but I'm feeling so weak now. Yeah, but someone has got a load of lambs in their pockets, and all the animals are so bad. <laughs> They're all in a bad state. But anyway, you want to see more of that next time? We, we'll start again and do it a bit in a proper fashion, I suppose, next time. So if you want to see more, tap the time that like button. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. And uh, I look forward to seeing you soon. Till then, have a fantastic weekend. Don't forget Icarus tonight. And we'll see you all soon. That starts at 10 o'clock BST. Uh, uh, sorry, GMT, not BST no more. Um, because we're out of the summer timetable. So 10 o'clock GMT, Icarus. And we'll see you later. Tell off for now.